Hello, Lincoln. I hope you've had a wonderful week. Uh, we're really excited this past week to have had our student conferences throughout our school in elementary, middle school, and high school. Um, it's been a great opportunity for us to reflect, and I hope that you've learned a little bit more about your students' learning. The most important thing is to celebrate our successes, reflect on our learning, and to set some goals for the future. This week has been very exciting as we have focused on Earth Week. The theme is refuse, repurpose, and reuse. Our students have, we've encouraged our students to refuse um, having meat at at least one meal um, during the course of the week, to repurpose bottle caps through collection, and to reuse books through a book swap. Um, we've talked about the environment throughout all of our grade levels. Please keep those conversations going over the dinner table moving forward, and hopefully you and your children can join us on Saturday morning at 9 a.m. tomorrow for uh, the, at Paraná and El Rio, we're meeting and we'll be doing a beach cleanup just from 9 to 10.30. Our high school students and faculty have organized a climate summit. We're inviting four area schools and a number of students to spend Friday and Saturday with us, learning and engaging in conversations, and it will culminate on Saturday afternoon with a, a presentation of and ratification of their final proposals. 115 in the auditorium, it's open to you and your families. In continuing their work around activism, our Gender and Sexuality Alliance Student Club organized the Day of Silence. This is a day that many schools participate in to raise awareness around discrimination in school settings against gay, lesbian, bisexual, transgendered students. Our students, with the support of our faculty and administration, uh, took a vow of silence throughout the morning and into the early afternoon in, in a way to honor and raise the consciousness of our community. Throughout the year, we've talked about our participation in the SAC tournament. Lincoln aligns with six other schools throughout our region, bringing students together for opportunities to participate in leadership, skill development, athletics, arts. This week, we've had a group of students away in Uruguay. It's the first ever STEAM conference. They're coming together to wonder, to learn, and to play around topics related to science, technology, engineering, arts, and math. We also have a group of students who are in Sao Paulo, in Brazil, participating in tennis and in basketball. We wish our students the very best of luck. Below you'll see a link if you'd like to watch some of the games uh, and activities that are happening. Next Friday is our senior's last day. Over the coming weeks, they're going to be taking their IB exams and preparing for the end of the year. Those of you who know a parent of a senior student, make sure you give them a hug. I know that these transitions are always really exciting and also difficult for us. I'm really excited to highlight an event that we're hosting here at Lincoln next Wednesday, the 26th of April at 5.15 in the auditorium. We're doing a talk on artificial intelligence in education a chance to explore opportunities and challenges. We've got a panel with parents, faculty, and students who we're really excited about that are gonna to come together to have a conversation with us about the future of artificial intelligence and how some of the things that have been happening globally over the past few months will impact what schools look like in the years to come. We look forward to seeing you there. Make sure you click the link below and register to attend. Thank you, Lincoln Condors. Have a great weekend.